Hello everybody. How are you all? Hope you're all okay and healthy and, you know, be grateful for everything you have, you know, and all that. Um, but anyway, you know, that's important. But anyway, what a time to get in to Petco Health and Wellness right now. Ticker Wolf. <laughs> it's trading at the time of this video, it's trading at nine dollars and seventy six cents and that's a all-time low that's an all-time low this stock is extremely undervalued extremely undervalued the PE ratio is 24 um, they're profitable why wouldn't you want to invest in a nice profitable business um, it's not like they don't make money uh, they profit $119 million. Uh, let me read you this article from Motley Fool. Good article. The pet industry is benefiting from the growing number of pets in this country. The ASPCA estimates 23 million Americans adopted new pets during the pandemic. Put it all together and it's clear pet, own, pet care can be a huge opportunity with powerful growth drivers behind it. A solid combination for any portfolio. And continuing on, Petco is working to be a more di diversified company. Uh, while pet food keeps customers coming in on a regular basis, Petco also provides veterinary services, grooming, training, pet insurance, making it a one-stop shop for pet owners. The company's vital care program gives customers access to unlimited veterinary visits, uh, discounted grooming, discounts on food, and other perks for just $19.99 a month. When I read that, I, I, I'm, I'm, I, I'm going to, I think I'm going to do that. <laughs> uh, I'm going to yeah, I mean, that's insane. Unlimited veterinary vet uh, visits and discounts on food and for $19.99 a month. Um, all right, let me continue reading. This, this source of recur recurring revenue creates a flywheel effect and provides Petco with a, a moat against online sellers that compete in the category like Amazon and Chewy. The company now has over 282,000 active vital care members who spend more than normal customers, ultimately accounting for a lifetime value that is 3.5 times higher than that of non-members. With the number of vital care members nearly tripling year over year in the second quarter, recurring revenue surged 54%. The program has plenty of room to, uh, to keep growing and Petco just opened up vital care to owners of small pets, reptiles, birds. Um, CEO Ron Coughlin says the company has a robu robust roadmap of enhancements to come, which will allow it to add many more members and capture further share of wallet. Petco also gained 325,000 net new customers in the second quarter, good for its 14th straight quarter of customer growth indicating that this all-encompassing strategy seems to be gaining traction. The stock trades at 17.5 times forward earnings, right in line with the average multiple for the S&P 500. This is an attractive valuation for a company with a strong tailwind, tailwinds to sustain its current momentum. Its price-to-earnings growth ratio of less than 0.7 is also a strong sign that, pen, that the pet company is undervalued relative to its earnings growth, making shares of Petco a compelling buy. And that is an understatement. Um, I got it, I, I, I had to get in Petco, I got in this. Um, I'm just gonna hold, I mean, all time low, extremely undervalued. Um, yeah, so tell me what you guys all think. And uh, are you gonna buy? Um, <laughs> That's it. Just tell me what you think. <laughs> and have a great day, everybody. All right? Bye-bye.